Hey, this is Coach Zach from Baseball Stars. We're going to do a video analysis for Andrew. Andrew's been taking lessons for the last four months or so, and he's been uh, doing it once or twice a week, uh, pretty steady here for the last four months. So the video on the left was taken on April 21st, 2018, and his top velo, his top velocity on the mound was 43.8 on April 21st, and the video on the right-hand side, August 10th, his velocity uh, has increased to 48.4. So that's a pretty good jump in the last four months. I've seen a lot of improvement with Andrew. He's been working really hard in lessons uh, a couple days a week. So we're going to take this point by point and look at his pitching mechanics before and after. So I'm going to take this through one time. Okay. So coming through here uh, on the leg lifts, Right away, I see a big improvement here with Andrew and his uh, when he starts. So on the left-hand side, he's breaking his hands super early, and he kind of gets in, into his leg lift, and he kind of gets into like a crouch, um, but he doesn't really close off his front side very well on the left-hand side. And so you can see that he's kind of got um, his knee is kind of just straightened out, and he's got he's not, doesn't really have his foot back. It's kind of pointed straight, and he's kind of going into almost like a crouch here on the left hand side uh, then so we on the right hand side we've been working really hard kind of like from a slide step uh, de really developing getting that good hip lead out in front trying to get good momentum down the mound uh, and making sure that we're staying closed with our legs a little bit better so you can see that he's got his foot back he's got his knee back his hip is uh, closed and then he's got his chin back looking over his shoulder so that overall looks better here at the beginning really getting that hip out in front now one thing that I do uh, want to show you let me draw a line here let me go a little bit further okay so um, here on the left hand side you are traveling a little bit further away from the rubber sooner um, so here on the right hand side you can see that your back leg is kind of getting lined up uh, like if we're getting ready to jump up and shoot like a basketball or something so we're not quite getting that back knee in line through our hips so on the left hand side we were kind of getting that knee lined up a little bit better through our hips this way but we're just opening up super early with our legs on that left hand side so coming through here that's actually going to affect your stride a little bit on the right hand side so we don't quite get that knee lined up where we can drive through it all the way here so we do get a little bit better stride on the left hand side but you're opening up super early um, through your hips and through your chest on that left hand side so you're definitely staying closed a lot better through the hips so if you watch that front foot on the right hand video and so right here you open up the hips at the last second so that looks good you're keeping your hips closed uh, you're opening up at the right time but we just need to work a little bit more on getting that back drive leg or that back drive knee in line through your hips sooner okay so just getting down a little bit more into that drive leg is going to help you push get a little bit longer stride um, kind of like what you had there on the left so going come in here into front foot strike uh, you're still open so but on the left hand side you're open a lot more so you can see that your chest is already completely open on that left hand side uh, you're a little bit more closed on the right hand side but we're still a little bit open so working a little bit more on staying closed making sure that when you land that you've got your front elbow pointed towards your target um, on both sides and just overall making sure trying to land with a little bit of separation so you always want to make sure that when you land with your front foot let's go to front foot that your hips are open so your hips should, should be all the way open and then shoulders back so that's going to create the most torque the most most separation on a throw to take more stress off the arm and so we can use our body a little bit more but and so real good stabilization on that front foot so coming through here you don't see that knee move at all um, and you get a little bit of extension there so uh, one thing you could do a little bit better though try to get that front leg straight and extended through your release so kind of like right here as you release it you want to try to pop that front leg straight um, so that's one thing you could do a little bit better on that end. I could possibly add another mile an hour or two on your throw alone, just stabilizing that knee a little bit better and getting that straight through your release. So coming through here, let's do a quick recap here, things that we can maybe work on, um, things that we're doing well. 
So up through your leg lift, I really like how you're starting off close through the lower body. You're getting that hip out in front, but we just need to move forward just a little bit quicker to get that back knee to get the back knee in line through your hips at this point. So you're still pretty vertical on that back knee. Now, a good job staying closed with the lower body there. You want to keep the chest closed. You start to open up here with your chest. So you want to make sure you're keeping your chest closed. A little bit more drive off that back leg. Get a longer stride. Make sure that we're still stabilizing that front foot. And then through your release, you want to try to get that front leg to come straight. But uh, good, real good job, Andrew. I've seen a lot of improvement over the last four months working with you. And if you keep working at this pace, I really think that you have a you have a good future in baseball. You keep working at it and just um, really really working hard and improving your mechanics. And I really see a, a good future in uh, in baseball for you.